Okay. Yeah, we spot a squirrel up here. It's about uh, 60 yards in. <clears throat> There's a branch that's in the way, but let me see if I could take it off in the head, okay, from here. Let me see. It's about... Oh, almost. Almost. There it goes. Right on. <laughs> Let's go pick it up, buddy. There it goes. Okay, you put it on. You put it on. That's about 50 yards, right, Charlie? Oh, I don't know. I... Anyway, I shot him in the head. The first shot, it, it just went right over it. The second shot, right on, on the spot. Uh, stay right here, I'll climb the fence. Uh, okay. Ow, whoa. There it goes. Let's see if I could squeeze through here. Wow. There's a lot of things here. Oh, there it goes. I'm gonna ran and jump, but. Huh? I'm gonna ran and jump. High, <laughs> high hurdle. Yeah, no. Damn. No, I got stuck here. <laughs> yeah, what a way to make a video, huh? Now I know how a deer feel getting, getting stuck in these barbed wires. <laughs> Alright guys, sorry about that. Go pick it up. Uh, it's a fox squirrel. Fell somewhere down here. Uh, let's see. It's up here. Oh, okay. I think it's one tree over. Yeah, it's a little bit back, further back. Oh, there it is. Oh, no. Hey, Xiao Feng, you know, Ke Dao, no? It's a. Uh, very good size uh, a fox squirrel. There we go. Just throw it over. Yeah, just it's throw a it. headshot right there. You want to grab it? All right. Now. Yeah, it is good size. Yeah. Now let me see if I can get out. Hold on. All right, guys. Uh, I'm gonna wave my. I'm gonna make my way. Uh, out of this area and we got to continue on forward and see if we could get some more squirrel in okay all right guys let's stay tuned now and we get back with you all right charlie let's bag it up and uh let's all move right. on but you're on the main trunk right yeah on the main trunk that v it's the first v the main trunk you keep going up keep going up it's in that V. Okay, I see it now. Yeah, there you go, Charlie. You got it. You got it, man. Yeah, let's, I just see his back. No, his head is on okay, top. Okay, I see it. Okay. All right. Put a pellet right through yeah, it, buddy. Let's see. Okay, make sure it's record. Okay. All right, man. I got faith in you, Charlie. Oh, nice. Nice job, you hit it. Well, I, he hasn't felt. Yeah, right there. Yeah, it's it's coming out. It's it's gonna drop. <laughs> it's laying flat on that uh, that bark over there, that that branch. So go over there, go over there. It's on the other side. It's on the other side. I don't know where you hit it, but I think yeah, it hit it, it right behind. Yeah, it's right there. It's coming down. Go over there and uh, shoot it. It's injured. You see it? Nope, not yet. Oh, 
Oh, there right he is. there, right there. It's on my side. It's on my side. Don't shoot it. It's on my side. It's it's on my side. Okay, chase it. Whack it with your stick. Go, 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 go. Whack it with the stick. It's a, right there, right there. Whack it, whack it, whack it, <laughs> whack it. <laughs> He's. Uh, I think I got him in the shoulder. Uh, okay, where they went to? In, inside those rocks? Yep. It's no problem, man. You know what? Move the rock. I don't know if I can see it. Move the rock. Okay, which which part of the rock did it went to? This right here. Which crack? Right. Oh, that big one? Yeah. That's gonna be tough. Huh. Okay. So uh Apparently, Charlie hit it, but I think he hit a little bit low, so the, uh, so the squirrel ran. Oh, he's still there. In here. Oh, you, can you see it? Let me just shoot it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shoot it from there. Shoot it from there and, uh, and uh, stick your hand in and grab it. Do you see the tail? I see his head. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Shoot it, shoot it. Shoot it. All right, folks. So, so Charlie saw the head, so he's going to shoot it. Oh, did you get it? Yeah. Oh, right on, buddy. Let me see where I actually right shot on. it. Right on. Okay, so... I think I actually shot his shoulder. Oh, okay. There it is. Yep, go grab his tail, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, here. Hold here, on. Charlie. Here, grab, grab with your shooting sticks. Here. Here, I think I can... You I sure? Can grab him. You got it? Right on, buddy. Okay. Wow, look, look at that. that. Look at that, folks. Let me see where I shot it okay, first. Okay, so the first shot. I think you shot him in the heart, man. It was a heart shot. Right? Was it? Was it a heart shot? No, I shot him like right above the arm. Oh, where the, where the shoulder? Right there. Okay. No, I only saw like this part. Mm, I, I see. I shot him right there. I see. Well, anyway, you hit him. Yeah. So, uh... Uh, you got lucky that it didn't go far inside these uh, wood, this rock crack. So, uh, <coughs> uh, yep. Congratulations, Charlie. Right on. That was uh, a journey. Yeah, it was a journey. But. And uh, also, you know, the cameraman uh, do not know how to uh, get direction. <laughs> <laughs> it says branch but there's thousands of branch right which which branch <laughs> but anyway uh again oh. congratulations charlie right. you got a nice big fat fox squirrel yeah, and bad, uh, too bad it's a female though oh um, it's okay man yeah, uh, yeah this is a uh, uh, this is an area that that we uh we we come but we don't normally come so uh i believe this year we only come here uh, this is the second time and first time we came here uh, right before the hickory season yeah, and yep, we yep. didn't do very good yeah yeah because there there wasn't any fruit on the tree so uh, uh today we decided to come here also and uh and we uh that's our we, luck we saw two squirrel well three but uh they uh, ran two ran away so th this is the third one so charlie was able to uh um, uh, harvest it and uh, yep we'll be moving forward and uh, see if uh, Charlie could get another one stay right. tuned now folks all right Charlie let's bag it up buddy let's go all right folks uh, we came to this area and uh, we sat for a little bit and uh, Charlie saw a raccoon right there at that tree hole and uh, it is also raccoon season so uh, guess what, guys? <laughs> All right, Charlie. Uh, aim it for the, the head, and hopefully it'll. Hopefully, uh, hopefully you will get it. Um, he's turned inside. Oh, he's turning on the side. Yeah, he was looking out. Now he's looking in. He might turn around, but right now he's got his butt to us, his back to us. Yeah, right there on the side. See his head poking on the side? Yeah, but that's not going to make him come out. Oh. He'll be dead in there. Well, okay, well, just record it then. Just turn on your side shot and, 
and record it and then uh oh there's his head right there right there oh you got him oh, oh, oh there he goes there he goes coming out oh <laughs> good shot charlie well let's go take a look at him man charlie's having raccoon for dinner tonight I don't think I recorded it. Huh? <clears throat> I think I actually turned the GoPro off. Did you? I did. Oh, man. I did because uh, when I <clears throat> when I said that he had his back toward us, I, well, I think I turned for? it off. Oh, man, Charlie. Well, folks, there you go. Charlie thought he pressed record, but he turned it off instead. But anyway, we'll show you the proof that Charlie shot a raccoon. There you go. Pick it up, Charlie. Pick up your raccoon. First raccoon opening season, right? Yeah. I'm it's sure dead. he's dead. Well, it's, it's a, dead. It was yep. a head shot, so yeah, he yeah. has to be dead. Shot him in the head. Whoa, look at that. That's a nice, nice floppy raccoon. <sighs> Oh, yeah. Anyway, uh, we'll bring it to James, and James said that um, the raccoon tastes awesome. Yeah, he did. He, yeah. he did say that, didn't he? Yeah, he said that it tastes like a raccoon. <laughs> 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 but anyway, we'll bring it to James, and yeah. he'll cook it for us. One step less than uh, lobster and shrimp, right? Yeah, there you go, man. <laughs> there you go. All right, congratulations, Charlie. All right. We, that was uh, surprising. You know, we didn't expect it. But uh, you got it. All right, folks, we got to bag it up and uh, continue on our squirrel hunt. All right, folks, uh, we got back at the uh, farm and from the uh, other property. And uh, right here, uh, Charlie uh, spotted a squirrel. And he is stalking it right now. Right there, Charlie, that's good. It's about, we're from Charlie. It's about a good uh, I think he's gone. yard shot. Oh no, he's still there, he's still there. Oh, sorry, <laughs> sorry about the camera. Okay, this time make sure you hit the record, buddy. Yeah, trees in the way. I gotta get this. Yeah, side. move this way. Move a little bit to the left. Go ahead, you get closer. I'll stay back here. Actually, we move a little bit closer, so uh, from where I'm at, it's about 60 yards. Maybe where Charlie's at, about it's about 40 yard shot. You need time now, Charlie. He's double checking, make sure that it's on record. He smack it. Oh, that's definitely a hit shot, man. As I was saying <laughs> at the other property, he shot a fox squirrel and uh, <laughs> it hit the uh, shoulder. So uh, and we have to run after it. But right now, this one, dead on hit shot. Feel that. I hear that, uh, that crack, that pop. Right, and then this is the tree that every year, like during the fruiting season, uh, we always spot squirrel here. 
It seems like he saw one down here too. You see one, Charlie? No, it's a, oh, it's a branch. Oh, false alarm? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, you can pop this fence right here. It's dead branch. Yeah, right there. Here, let me go on this. Yeah. This is a little bit stouter. Yeah. I think that's a, a newbie, a newbie because it didn't run. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it's probably a newcomer, yeah. All right, bring your squirrel down here. Let's see if you got it in the head. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's a nice box squirrel. It's not the biggest one, but uh, it's a fox squirrel. Another female. Yeah, right. Be oh, um, nice job, man. Headshot too. Headshot. Yep. Headshot. Sad that it was another female, though. No, but yeah. I mean, there's a lot of squirrel around here, so uh, harvesting uh, a few here and there. Believe me, Charlie, we, we can never dent these squirrels. <laughs> All right, guys. Cal spotted a squirrel up there. Okay. Yeah. All right, I Charlie. Think, did it move? No, no, it's still there. Just stay right there, Charlie. All right. I won't be able to get you and the... Yeah. You and the... Uh... Yeah, it's, uh, it's up here. Okay, so so it's, it actually uh, turned to the other side. So could you slowly walk over there, Charlie? Don't worry, I'm shooting up, so I'm not going to hit you. Hold on, Charlie. Just stay right there. Just stay right there. Stay right there. You got it? Yeah, I got it. Whenever you're ready, I'll, I'll just Yeah, you want to come fall. here and film me on the back? From the back? You just do like a big loop. Yeah, there you go. Let me... <laughs> and when you came this way, he's, he um. hit his head. <laughs> so he hit his head again. Yeah, try to go at that angle then and kind of just like like okay right there Charlie right there right there I'll just capture it fall okay Oh, I got that branch. <laughs> There's a twig right there. Just go ahead and go around this way. Go around. Yeah. There you go. Maybe it will turn towards me again. Okay, right there, Charlie. Right there. Right there. Just stop right there. Ready? Okay, I'll just capture. There you go. It's stuck. Yeah, it's coming down. Shot him in the... Oh, I got that branch. Ready? There you go. <laughs> shot him in the uh, forehead. <laughs> well, the first shot. Here, let me it, uh, let me get away from the sun here. Oh yeah, yeah. Turn, turn around. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So actually, the first shot, um, I hit the the, uh, the twig in between it, and uh, the second shot, I was able to hit him in the 
And they're right in the forehead too. And it's a big male. So, oh yeah, that is. So it's a big male. See? Yeah, that's the one I seen. Yeah, hit him right across. The, hit him right in the forehead right here. Ooh, right. Well, actually, uh, the yeah, yeah, right there. So, <laughs> right, Japan, you know. For that, try to like auto na hong to ye ku um, lot on like ku to like ito na le. So I already got two fox squirrel, and uh, now I got another fox squirrel. So uh, uh, we'll be uh, uh, moving forward this way and see if we could uh, uh, spot some uh, some more squirrel. Uh, ho hopefully, hopefully uh, this time, uh, let's see if we could get some gray. But uh, uh, during this hour, usually it's fox squirrel. So, but we we would love to get some grays uh, for a change. And uh, we've been lucky. Uh, we've been um, we've been here. We've been really lucky here yeah, in this area. Yeah, yeah. So so we've been very lucky today. The squirrels are out. It's a very nice day. Kind of windy, and the wind is cold. So uh, yeah. So anyway, okay. Chào mừng nhé. Bây giờ đã có mua bể bể hôm nay nó mua bể chơi xe xe bò vô bò na. Uh, 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 shine, okay? uh, 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 Any time now. There he goes. Right between the gap. Scared the cow too. Yeah. There he goes. Right between the gap. <laughs> oh, good thing that it is two of us or else we will never able to get this squirrel it's a small squirrel all right folks uh here oh, you go big one it's a big male oh wow Head shot too so anyway um all right so we gotta continue on and uh, see if we can get some more stay tuned now all right well, it's perfect timing there for i think we're in the way All right, guys, uh, saw a squirrel over here and it was perching on that tree next to its hole, but uh, for some reason, uh, it went back into the, uh, into the hole and uh, here, right there. Okay, see, you see this, his head is poking out right there, <laughs> right there, but uh, yeah, right there. See, I could have shot it right there. But uh, anyway, we're not gonna shoot it. Um, I'm just gonna let it be and uh, leave this squirrel alone. And uh, if we do come back again, if we see it out, then uh, we will uh, uh, take a shot at it. But right now, um, I'm just uh, making a video of this squirrel. And uh, so we will let this one go for now. There's his head right there. Oh, it went back to the hole. Okay. Well, lucky squirrel. <laughs> yeah, that's a lucky squirrel. So, well, guys, uh, gals, uh, we are not bad people anyway. <laughs> After all, uh, we uh, saved this squirrel for now. We'll come back and um, hopefully he or she <laughs> don't come out of the hole. If he does, then uh, we'll definitely try to get a shot at it. and. Uh, we get to move on forward and uh, see um, what what we can find. Okay. All right, folks. Um, just as we about to leave, and I kind of glance back, and the squirrel is out of his hole. So I get. I guess uh, it was meant to be. Yeah, it was meant to be. So I'm gonna try to take a shot at it. See if I can hit him.
There he goes. I got him. It's hanging, it's down. Headshot looks like, because it's uh, flopping around. Oh yeah, it is a headshot. There he goes. I got him. It's hanging, it's down. I, I just barely see its head, you know what I mean? And uh, it's still flopping. <laughs> it's still flopping. <clears throat> yeah, I was about to save his life, but uh, uh, he decided to poke his whole body out. So uh, we were able to uh, take the shot. And besides, um, it is the law. We are not allowed to shoot squirrel inside the nest or uh, even his head sticking out of the hole. So, uh, yeah, so it's against the law to do that. In this case, it came out of the hole and it was perching on the other side of this tree. So, uh, I was man managed to uh, sneak the pellet right through it and right there, head shot or ear shot. It's a small, it's a small meal. It's chubby though. Yeah, chubby, but it's tender. It's going to be good. Uh, the wife will like it. <laughs> And uh, we get a, a continue on. And uh, next up, uh, we'll give Charlie an opportunity. Another chance. Yeah, see if he could uh, <laughs> get in. A, uh, well, shoot at a squirrel, okay, instead of missing it. <laughs> All right, I'm just encouraging you, Charlie. I know. Yeah. All right. I so, am switching to slugs, though. Yeah. Yeah, he is. Uh, he uh, learned his lesson, you know, shooting in the wind. Um, he already sighted his gun out for shooting a, a 22 grain slugs and uh, no more excuse for Charlie, okay? All right, stay oh, tuned. It's now. always the uh, shooter, not the gun. Yeah, it's always the shooter, of course. <laughs> All right, folks. Uh, well, uh, me and Charlie uh, came to our log that normally produce uh, mushrooms and uh, there's some right there, so uh, uh, right now, I'm I'm getting a bag so that uh, uh, I could go harvest it and hey, squirrel, uh, squirrel, 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 squirrel. Yeah, grab your gun. Oh, it. grab your gun. Oh, there's a squirrel right there. Yep. Oh man, where'd he go? It's over here. The evergreens. Oh. Where'd he go? It went into those evergreen, those cedars. Oh. That would've been a good uh, <laughs> yeah, that'd video. Be a, yeah, that'd be a good one right there. Oh well, but anyway. Well, uh, we missed the opportunity. Yeah, we missed that opportunity right there. And uh, okay, uh, let me uh, go over here and uh, pick up some of these uh, oyster mushrooms for you guys. Oh, Oh, this thing is. is. Yeah, there you go. There All we right. go. Okay, jump on you now. Let's on that. Yeah. Oh yeah, we're gonna go and talk to our chef. Hey, do you play it? I go to Charlie. It's in danger now. Yeah. We're gonna talk to that. Um, you're more in danger Wow, look at that, Charlie. <coughs> wow. They're not they're not super big. But they're frozen? Oh, just perfect. Right there. Oh. <laughs> yeah, they're frozen, but it's good. Get to pick all of them so we could have them for uh for lunch. All right, so these are oyster mushroom folks, and they're frozen. And uh, let's see if Charlie has a pocket knife there, do you? I always do. You do, huh? All right, buddy. Yeah. It's child proof, so uh, <coughs> gotta learn how to open it. Oh, it's child proof? Okay. Well. <clears throat> 
yeah it's always good to have a pocket knife with you <sighs> whoa <laughs> The, It'll be like me last time, remember? Oh, yeah. I cut yeah. myself because it was frozen. Yeah. These are... These are frozen. Hard frozen. Man, but... The good thing about uh, oyster mushroom at this time of the year is that... Um, they don't have no bugs. <laughs> and... uh we know that they are oyster mushroom is because uh, uh, we have been um, eating them uh, for a while now. And besides, uh, this log right here always produced mushroom every year. Uh, so okay, we have probably like a half, like yeah, maybe a, a quarter pound here, and. Uh, there you go. Uh, Let's see if we could get some uh, squirrel, and uh, uh, we'll do some uh, uh, squirrel cookout. Um, make some squirrel, uh, braised squirrel with uh, oyster mushroom, okay? Yeah, your point, you know. There are jinjay, no, jay, play. Peto to na, jay, play, you are more oyster ngay na, no. All right, folks. Uh, so, uh, uh, well, actually, uh, <laughs> welcome back to the channel. Uh, me and Charlie just got here, and uh, we got here pretty late. Um, we drive by this road that we always uh, harvest uh, oyster mushroom, and uh, surely we saw some. So uh, uh, we uh, harvested it already, and uh, me and Charlie, we get to go out this way and uh see if uh we uh, i can find some squirrel okay and uh just to let you guys know this is the second day um the first day um i um uh was successful i got my limit of 10 squirrel so we uh, cooked some for dinner and uh this morning we woke up late and uh we uh, went to town and just came back uh, from town and uh, to get some ingredients for uh, the uh, squirrel cook and uh, yeah so uh, let's see what happens and uh, let's see we could uh, get a few squirrel in and uh, we'll make some squirrel stew okay all right folks stay tuned and uh, uh, let's see we get lucky this morning yeah we almost got lucky earlier oh That's yeah true. yeah yeah that he one wasn't that fast off. enough yeah <laughs> well actually i didn't see it uh, charlie uh saw it so and the squirrel was running like crazy all right buddy uh, ready turn it off all right guys uh we saw a squirrel over here so i'm gonna slowly get, to get out slow. of the car and get my shooting sticks all right charlie can you loop him in back of the pickup truck what Come back here. Yeah, there you go. Uh, let's see. It's a, it's a good, it's a good thirty yards, huh? Okay. I'm getting ready to take this shot. Oh, it's that damn cocky gun. Oh, I got it. That's a... Got it. That's a big <laughs> impact. <laughs> Damn. Let's go pick it up. Oh, man. All right, guys. Uh, me and Charlie, we were planning to go down this road, right? And... uh. I saw a fox squirrel on my on my right side, and uh, me and Charlie we decided to get out of the car. Oh, it's still uh, it's it's still moving. And then so anyway, we got out of the car, set up, 
And uh, yep, I shot it. It's about a good 35, 40 yard shots. Still plopping around. Yeah. Oh man, look at that, it's a headshot, dude. Man. Oh, oh it's a little one. Yeah, this is a tender one. Oh, All right, here. so hold we on, got hold. we got one. Hold on, hold on. Let me let me adjust. It was tilted wrong. Okay. Okay. All right. So uh, anyway, um, here it is. It's a young tender fox squirrel. So we will use this one since it's tender uh, to uh, to make a uh, squirrel stew uh, the way I like to make it. Okay. And uh, I'll show you how to uh, how to cook it. And uh, yeah. It's gonna be tasty, and of course, um, Charlie's uh, gonna be the guinea pig, so he's gonna eat it and uh, <laughs> tell you guys how it tastes. And we got mushrooms to go with. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, and and yeah, don't forget about the mushroom we picked earlier this morning. So uh, yeah, all right, Japan, you know, tola itu na hong tu na je. Ini pepe yo mo wa show do an je na. All right, folks, uh, Charlie just shot a squirrel. And uh, it was so close, and then it was so fast that uh, we didn't have a a chance to uh, to to film it all the way through. But uh, yeah, he was on the he was on the move, and I think I aimed for his head, but I guess I got him in the lungs. Yeah. Well, hopefully, uh, Charlie will have the kill shot footage. But, uh, yep. There you go. All right, folks. Uh, me and Charlie just came back uh, from hunting uh, on the second day. And uh, we uh, were able to uh, uh, shoot, uh, I think, five or six squirrel uh, total. And uh, uh, we picked some mushroom earlier. And uh, we... Uh, picked one squirrel which is the the youngest one so it's a fox squirrel so I'm gonna use that one uh, to make my uh, one of my signature uh, squirrel stew and uh, yeah right now Charlie is uh, uh, testing out his uh, his 800 millimeter 22 uh, m3 right here and uh, uh, he's gonna get get this gun ready uh, for the uh, evening shift but uh, as for now, uh, I'll be uh, taking care of the squirrel. So uh, let me bring you to the squirrel. Okay, uh, let me set you guys down right here. Nice and easy. So my <laughs> my camera don't uh, tell. So uh, let me see. Let me. Oh, sorry. Let me put you down here so you can see the squirrel. All right. Okay, here's the squirrel right here. Uh, let me grab a knife. And of course, a uh, uh, blowtorch. Um, I don't know if you guys can see me, but uh, <clears throat> pretty much you guys can see the squirrel. Um, I will be uh, uh, singeing the hair off. And um, <clears throat> so the way we do this, uh, we just use a, a blowtorch and uh, remove the hair. This this been done uh, during out the. Uh, or ancestor way back then. Uh, so uh, let me cinch your hair out. And uh, so you guys will get an idea of uh, how we uh, clean the squirrel uh, without uh, removing the, uh, the skin, okay? And the reason why we do this because the skin has most of the fat in there and, and the collagen. And uh, supposedly it makes it taste a little bit better um, but more gamey though okay and this is the way uh, our ancestors uh, grandma grandpa mom and dad um, has been doing it and uh, yeah so I'm gonna show you this style of cooking and then uh, the next time when me and Charlie are out hunting again I'll show you a different style uh, which is removing the uh, skin and just use utilize the meat okay so uh, as you can see right here um, we removed most of the hair already and um, 
when I'm done with this, it's going to be super clean. Okay, I'm going to put it in the pot. 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 Okay. And uh, Charlie uh, never had squirrel made this way before, so uh, basically I'm gonna make this dish uh, for Charlie uh, to try, and also for you guys to uh, to uh, see how how we cook it. And if you guys do like it, then uh, you know just go ahead and uh, try it out and uh, see how it tastes like. Basically, uh, <laughs> it tastes like squirrel, but it, it, but don't worry, it's not gonna taste like burnt squirrel like you're looking at it right now. Okay. So. Back home when. Uh, uh, my grandma and grandpa, um, uh, they live in the village, so uh, there's no such things as a blowtorch. So basically, uh, oop. <laughs> basically, uh, it is just uh, make an open fire like you see back in back of me, and uh, they would just uh, they would just uh, uh, put it in there and then uh, singe the hair off. And it does make the squirrel look uh, look black, dark. With this technique right here, uh, you remove all the hair. So it's basically it's just like uh, a pig, you know, removing the the hair off from a pig. So basically, it is just a small version of it. And um, instead of a pig, you have a squirrel. I'm going to fast forward some of this because the timeline is going to be so long so uh, I'm going to uh, stop talking and uh, for a while and just do this and uh, fast forward some so that I could get everything on the video okay. All right, so uh, after when I cinch it, uh, I'm just gonna wash it in water and uh, basically uh, try to take any uh, any of these uh, char out. So the squirrel's gonna be uh, nice and uh, clean. We already remove all the uh, hair out, so this is just the skin now. We'll be using the whole squirrel, except the inner uh, tail, heads, and all. This recipe that I'm making, it's it's kind of like a a, a curry squirrel dish okay so it's going to be a cur curry base uh, squirrel and uh, there's some uh, fresh ingredient that I'll show you later on once I'm done with cleaning this squirrel while I'm doing this Charlie's still uh, <laughs> 
tuning his uh, 800 millimeter uh, 22 uh, in pack. And by the time he's finished, he'll be hungry. And uh, he's gonna uh, give this squirrel a try. And uh, he'll give you guys a rating between one to 10 and see how he likes it. Okay, Japan, you know, uh, Alright guys, so uh, we gotta do this, we gotta do it right, okay? Mother Nature. Here's my cutting board. And uh, this is the, uh, the squirrel that I just cleaned. And uh, as you can see, it just looked like a, a little micro uh, pigs or piglets. <laughs> but anyway, it has white meat, just like chicken, but it doesn't taste like chicken. It has the texture of a chicken, but it, it tastes like a squirrel. So uh, I'm just going to quarter it. And you notice on the side, it has a glen. So what I do is I remove uh, the glen so that it's going to take away the, uh, the gaminess. Also on the armpit, it has a, a glen here too. So got to remove that. It's fine. If you don't remove it, but I just do, I just want to remove it. All right. So I got my, uh, uh, my squirrel here. Now, these are the mushroom that uh, we picked this morning. I'm putting it inside this pot because I'm going to be uh, cleaned it out. Let's get to rinse it out with water. Normally, uh, we don't do that because mushrooms absorb water. But it's going to be a, a stew. So uh, it's collecting water. That's fine. Because uh, it's going to squeeze out that water onto the uh onto the stew anyway yeah these are very young tender okay uh, and these are the two biggest one out of the bunch right here and, uh, Let's get some of these uh, ingredients ready. Okay. These are scallions. Okay, what I have here is is uh, fresh uh, turmeric. Well, it used to be fresh, but uh, I, uh, I bought it fresh and put it in the freezer. Okay, just use a little bit. A little bit goes a long ways. And these are the chilies that we get to put inside. So I normally just cut them in half and just put it aside.
course, uh, fresh kefir lime leaves. We have here uh, a ginger that I already uh, sliced it. And of course, uh, three cloves of garlic. Well, four cloves of garlic. The more the merrier. All right. And uh, what I have here is uh, it's a curry leaf. I don't know if you guys can see it right here. It's good if you could get it fresh. And uh, these are fresh, so these get to go into the cooking also. Okay. All right, so I'm going to put it up here. I'm going to get the, uh, the pan ready. And, of course, uh, I'm going to uh, clean this mushroom up. And, uh, and then we get to start cooking. All right, guys, I uh, already got everything set up. Um, here's the, uh, the ingredient right here, the squirrel. Here's the uh, mushroom uh, uh, that we just picked. How's that look, Charlie? Looks good. Yeah, so basically I'm just gonna brown it first. And after when it, when it gets browned up, uh, we gotta take it off to the stove and start putting our ingredients in there. So this is just like to, to brown it. And just let it sit. Check out this mushroom. <laughs> oh, that's what we picked? Oh, yeah, that's what we picked. Well, there's more, but, um, you know, it's that's plenty. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's all we need. need. Yeah, that's all we need. So how do you like it? You um, you fine with spicy, mild? Spicy, I'm high. <laughs> all right on, man. That's the answer I wanted to hear. So if a Thai or Hmong people say that, medium um, in translate to English it means hot <laughs> and then when when we say hot it means super hot <laughs> so we just gonna make it medium after 10 minutes when it is golden brown uh, just go ahead and uh, take it off the plate take it off the uh, the pan Right here's the uh, squirrel meat. Okay, uh, put it here. Here, let's put it all the way over here and see if I could remove this. Okay, remove that. Good thing we're outdoor, so pour a little bit of this fat out. Get back inside. <clears throat> okay, so throw in your ginger. Get back the meat. What I'm gonna do is 
You gotta add some water. At this time we get a lettuce simmer. Salt. Let it simmer in here for like, uh, uh, I think about like until it, until it gets tender. So this is probably a, uh, a very, uh, uh, young squirrel so let's put the green on the side for later uh, and it should take like about half hour to 45 minutes but uh, yeah There's three squirrels chasing one another. So, uh, one way into the tree already. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there it is right there, right there. Take it easy, okay? There it is, there it is. No, no, the cedar, the cedar tree. Okay, right there, right there. Go for it. Okay, you got it. Okay. There's one to the left, to the left. We'll find out. You see it? Take it easy. What? Do you see it there? Okay. All right, folks. Uh, Charlie shot. Yeah, Charlie shot 
there's three squirrel. The first one he shot. I think he nicked him in the nose. And then uh, the second one he hit it. It's a hit shot. So the two went over there. So try to leave your gun here and go get that squirrel and then come back here. Okay folks, so Charlie's gonna go retrieve the squirrel. Oh, it's still alive. <laughs> the squirrel's still alive. Here, let me zoom in. There it goes. <laughs> Did you just glaze that one too? Okay, bring it over here. I'll hit it with the stick or... Oh yeah, nice, nice. All right, yes, yeah, still alive. Oh, yeah, it's gonna die soon. Oh, there it is. Good job. I got yeah. it in the throat. All right, good job, good job. Okay. All right, folks. Uh, <clears throat> gonna stay here for a little bit, and um, we have thirty minutes to go because we have to go back and get the squirrel stew. <laughs> So we left it there at the campground, and we decided to do a uh, a short squirrel, and uh, before we hit back to the camp to uh, get dinner going, and to see how that squirrel stew is going. Okay. All right, folks. Uh, Charlie spotted a squirrel down there, right in front of me at my twelve. Oh, Charlie! It's going up on the tree. It's going up on the tree. Take it easy now. Right after 10 minutes, after the one that he just shot, yeah, it's going up, okay. Oh, man, that was like a little bit, it, it was kind of hanging, huh? Yeah. All right, bro. <laughs> Oh man, you better hit record on that one, right? You did? Oh man. Good job, bro. Good job. You hit it. Let's go pick it up. Yeah, like I was saying, um, when Charlie shot that one right there, he picked it up. We wait for another 10 minutes. And then this squirrel was running. Uh, well, was actually was on the ground. Uh, I'm searching for acorns or something, but anyway, um, when Charlie was trying to snuck out on it, 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 it went up the tree, and then uh, Charlie got it. Right on, bro. Where'd you show that one? Oh, right there, huh? Oh, nice. It's still breathing. Yeah, it's still breathing? Yeah, it's still breathing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, shoot him in the head. Okay, all right. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, he's just twitching. Yep. There we go. Okay, there we go. All yeah. right. Good job, bro. Good Going job, right bro. In the arm. It looks like uh, he wasn't fully this fast. Yeah. So. Good job, good job. So uh, uh, let's head back to the campground. I think our squirrel stew is ready. So uh, yeah, uh, during the uh, the morning, uh, like I mentioned it, uh, uh, me and Charlie was uh, hunting together, and uh, we uh, um, managed to uh, bag a, a few uh, squirrel here and there. And then uh, we went to the campground and uh, did the squirrel cook. And uh, right now it's sitting over there at the campground. It's simmering away. Yeah. And uh, so while we wait for that 45 minutes to an hour, we decided to come out here. And there you go, Charlie 
shot two more squirrel. Two. So yeah, Which congratulations. Because I, uh, I switched back to slugs. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't, that first part wasn't very accurate with, the, with pellets. I yeah. The wind, so switch it back to slugs and two for two. So. Yeah. So right now it is uh, four. Um, uh, this morning was like sunny and then all suddenly it's just starting to uh, get cloudy and right now it's like overcasting so let's get back and uh, get dinner going and then um, after that let's decide what we got to do next okay all right, all right. congratulations man all right. okay put that one with the other and then um, I'll get my stuff ready at, and uh, I'll meet you over there by your uh, backpack okay Alright folks, uh, me and Charlie, we just came back uh, from that quick hunt and uh, I'm going to put some uh, sweet sausage on the grill also. Um, Charlie got lucky, uh, we went over there and uh, he shot two great squirrel. So uh, I guess uh, by changing from pellets to slugs uh, really works. <laughs> for Charlie anyway um, so yeah uh, well this is our stew right here it's been simmering here um, I will be uh, putting it in the mushroom oh it's very tender now oh super tender okay so you gotta put in the mushrooms and the rest of the greens okay just gonna stir this now we're not gonna now we're not gonna let it simmer we we, we get a uh, make sure that it's gonna kind of like evaporate so that uh it's it gets that like gravy consistency on it so we're gonna put this back on the flame and uh yeah i don't know if you guys can see it but look at that Squirrel still. Okay. So I'm gonna take you guys off camera and uh, give it a few more minutes until the sausage gets cooked and uh, until this gets reduced down. And uh, yeah, then me and Charlie, we get a party, uh, have dinner and see what happens, okay? Let me put some more fire in there. Like all right guys uh i guess uh the squirrel stool is ready looks good look at that all right squirrel stew and mushroom so i'm gonna plate it for charlie and um have him uh have him try it so it's basically uh we have here is uh, Traditional sticky rice or sweet rice, uh, purple or blue sweet rice. I'm gonna take this for Charlie. Oh yeah. Okay, so oh look at that, it's so so tender that it just fall off the bone. Oh look at that, the meat just fall off the bone. Some mushroom to go with it. Oh here's a. Remove the ginger. And, oh, here it is. Here it is. It is. Oh, that's a leg. Yeah. Let's, right. let's remove the vegetables. Okay. And let's get this, and let's get a piece of meat. Right. Where's the meat? Okay. There it is. Okay. Okay. There you go. And of course, yeah. Uh, Right, so this is our uh, dinner. Okay, there you go, Charlie. Let me bring the camera over here. All right. Let me bring the camera over here. It's gonna help out with my stuff, you know. Yeah. All right, so, all right, Charlie. Let's try the. Uh... Yeah, let's try my cooking, huh? Well, this is the first time you try this style. Yep. And uh, give it a try. Is it tender? Oh, yeah. 
Yeah. How does it taste? Wow. That is good. Let's bring it closer. That is really oh, good, right guys. There. there you go. Look at that. Yeah. Nice mushroom. and tender, huh? Oh, yeah. And the mushroom? Look at that. Mm. All right. So, uh, I mean, uh, so. That's, uh, that's perfect. Rate that this, is, brother. Rate this. You know what? I, what do you I'd think? I'd give it way up there. but Way up there, huh? Way up there. I'm telling you. I'm hungry and <laughs> it's good right now. Yeah. Uh, It'd be so, a 10 of a little bit more spicy. Oh, there you go. <laughs> you know. Oh, darn it, man. Okay, you know, next time. People like it hot. Yeah, next time mm. I, I double in up on the uh, oh, um, yeah. on the uh, chili. But, uh, all right, mm. folks. Uh, well, this is how you get people to uh, enjoy uh, uh, squirrel stew, is take them hunting and then starve them. <laughs> starve them. <laughs> you may, yeah. You yeah, starve them. And then, all right. Uh, so, I guess... Um, uh well that's chinese salsa Jenna. yeah 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 so that's i sweet. guess uh yeah so i guess uh we get a, a call it a, a night um uh let me put the camera away and uh grab my dinner too and uh folks um i guess uh me and charlie um well we've been here for two days now and um the first day we did make some uh squirrel but um uh, um, it was off camera. Yeah, it was off camera. I think we and were too then, tired. Yeah, yeah, it was <laughs> off camera. And then today uh, we uh, decided to uh, uh, make this uh, a squirrel stew so that you guys would know. Um, we don't just throw them away. Yeah, there <laughs> you go. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, that we do eat them. And this is one of the way that I do it. There's many more ways. And um, maybe on the next video, if I have time, or if you guys want me to, then. Just go ahead and comment down and uh, I'll make some more uh, 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 squirrel dish for you guys to see. And uh, if you guys really, really wanted to uh, give it a try, then let me know and I'll put the ingredient down. And all you need to do is just grab an air rifle, go to the woods and uh, shoot and squirrel. Shoot one squirrel or two squirrel and just do it with or without the skin, okay? So uh, uh, we did good on the first day. Um, I did good, Charlie did good, and um, we hunted separately on the first day. So I will put some of Charlie's kill shot onto the video. And, Hopefully uh, it'll turn out good. Yeah, so I was doing a self film. And then uh, on the second day, we uh, hunt together and uh, like we normally do. And uh, yeah, so um, let's wrap this up. And I hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, and I guess I'll see you on the next one, okay? Um, until then, uh, stay uh, safe, okay? All right. And uh, if you guys get to see us again, it's probably next year. <laughs> so see you next year. <laughs>